not like she's homebound just because she signed on to hospice. We still are living every day like it was a normal day. She is the team making an impact across the country, suffering from inoperable brain cancer. Number 22 got to be a part of Mount St. Joe's starting five on Sunday. More than a game, it was an inspiration. In order for her to play and feel her best, Mount St. Joe petitioned the NCAA to move the game up to November 2nd. Of course, you know, they said it was going to be her last collegiate game, which is just the kind of person Lauren is to prove everybody wrong. So she's actually played in four college games and scored a total of 10 points. Besides basketball, some of my favorite Lauren moments have been when she gets her quirky, funny side and we get to laugh together. People who do know me, they know my other side. They kind of compare me to Dory the fish off of Nemo. I'm always laughing and smiling and trying to be cheerful. I'm making the most of my moments trying to make an impact and spread awareness and what I'm going through. I don't want others to have to go through it. What do you want to say to the people that are watching? Just donate to The Cure Starts Now. And I really think that if they get research for this tumor, they can find the home run cure and hopefully cure all cancers. Hospice is really, really helpful. And they're gonna help me reach that goal because they keep me on my feet and feeling as best as I can possibly feel. My symptoms are crazy and hospice is helping me stay on my feet and being the voice and trying to, you know, raise that money. I've learned that life is really special and that there's something good in every moment. And I like my son. Today is a perfect day for a perfect day. It just reminds me to be happy.